Hey, Cyber Warriors. My name's Steve Gorham. I'm the Chief Operating Officer for OpSWAT. Here at OpSWAT, our mission is to protect the world's critical infrastructure. Critical infrastructure is the technology systems and applications in both the information technology, IT environment, as well as the operational technology, OT environment. Our critical infrastructure security platform provides multiple lines of defenses from the IT all the way through the OT, ensuring safe and secure infrastructure. Let's get started so I can give you an overview of the Critical Infrastructure Protection Platform. Start with the OT environment. You cannot defend what you can't see. Our asset inventory management tool provides for a baseline of all of your OT assets in your environment. And should something offend that baseline, it doesn't just give you an alert, it gives you an actual picture of the device. So no more dealing with just arbitrary MAC addresses or IP addresses. You can see what you need to go defend against and be able to take action. If you have a requirement for remote access into your OT environment, our remote access security solution provides for secure access no matter where you are into your OT environment. Most OT environments have PLCs and HMIs. Our IDS IPS solution provides for protection for any programmatic code that's being passed to the PLCs or the HMIs. It's also easy because you don't have to change your network infrastructure as it can be plugged in line with your existing topology. Engineering workstations. Your engineering workstation in your OT environment provides the ability for you to pass those commands and those configurations to your PLC and your HMIs. We secure these engineering workstations by providing supply chain enforcement, ensuring that the device when it's put onto your OT environment is in fact free of vulnerabilities and even country of origin checking. Additionally, we can put an agent on this device so you have media validation to ensure that anything that's plugged into this device is scanned and is approved. Lastly, we also have an external USB firewall for the engineering workstation. This provides protection for a number of different removable medias should you need to insert them to put a file in your engineering workstation to then program a PLC or an HMI. So we talked about how we're gonna have files that are gonna be in our OT environment that we use to program or to update firmware in our PLCs and our HMIs. So how do we get those files and ensure that they're secure and not vulnerable to any malware or any other vulnerabilities? We have our kiosk solution. Our kiosk solution provides for many different media types, even floppy disks for those legacy systems. And we do multi-AV engine scanning, as well as CDR technology, content disarm and reconstruct to make sure any potential malicious code is removed before entering your OT environment. We have our big boy model, and we also have a portable model, the K2100. This model is great for when you're on the go, in the plant, or just in the field, and you need to scan that portable media. Once we have our file scanned and we know it's secure, we know it's without vulnerability, we want to get it into the OT environment. In many cases, OT environments are air-gapped. This unidirectional gateway gives us a physically proven method for one-way transfer of our file into the OT environment. And then once in the OT environment, we have the capability to put it into a secure file repository. Now, this isn't just a repository to hold the file we're actually gonna actively scan that file while it's in the repository to make sure no zero day vulnerabilities pop up and that file then becomes vulnerable when it was at once before. So now let's talk about the information technology or IT environment. We protect your supply chain with our Meta Defender Drive product. This gives you the ability to take transient devices that are both on and off your network and when, before they come back onto the network, we scan them. We make sure they're without vulnerability. We also have the capability to ensure that these devices are meeting your country of origin requirements. Moving from our supply chain protection mechanism, we have Meta Defender Core and ICAP. This gives us the ability to protect any of your file uploads coming into your organization. We know that organizations still rely on file upload, but we need to ensure that those files are scanned without vulnerability. And with our CDR technology, we're able to make sure that any potential malicious code is removed before that file is used in your environment. One of the biggest attack vectors we have still is email. Our email security gateway doesn't just provide for your standard anti-phishing or anti-malware protection mechanisms, although we do leverage our multi-AV scanning engines. It also provides for that same CDR technology going to ensure that your files coming through your email and your emails are not vulnerable to your organization when your users click on them. Our Meta Access product. Should you need remote secure access into your environment, our Meta Access solution can provide that. But it's not just a secure remote access solution. 
It actually gives you the ability to do posture checking on your endpoints, provides for compliance such as NERC SIP, so you can have a dashboard that shows where you stand from a NERC SIP perspective, among many other different compliance mechanisms. It provides for that same multi-AV engine scanning uh, a possibility, and it even has keylogger protections and screen share protections. Many organizations are still using storage. They have lots of file repositories in storage. Our secure storage solution gives you the capability to multi-AV scan those files, even take advantage of our CDR technology, and they're able to do this on a real-time basis. So you can put your files in there and rest assured that once these files are retrieved, they're free without vulnerability. My name's Stephen Gorham. I am the Chief Operations Officer for OpsWAT. To learn more about our critical infrastructure protection platform, go to www.opswat.com.